Westar Distribution would like to show you an example of air spring to coil spring conversion kits today. If your vehicle's factory equipped air spring suspension has been damaged and you find the replacement parts either too expensive or not available, you may want to convert the suspension to the old style coil spring suspension. This is possible with a conversion kit supplied by Westar Distribution. We are in Memphis, Tennessee at Steve's Tire and Auto. Chris is going to demonstrate how this conversion kit is installed on our modified Lincoln Town Car frame. Before going into the details of the conversion, we must point out to you certain important safety steps. Read instructions before disassembly and installation. Disconnect the battery cable and turn off the suspension switch. This switch is generally found in the trunk of the vehicle. Always wear protective gear, such as safety glasses, gloves, and earplugs. The tools that you'll need are a floor jack, jack stands, a socket set, a torque wrench, an 18 millimeter wrench, and a pry bar. On our demo vehicle, we will have to simulate certain steps since we do not have an actual car here. Chris will first shut off the power on our control panel as you would turn off the air suspension switch in the trunk. For purposes of this demonstration, we will only convert one side of the suspension. We are going to lift and support the rear of the car. Please refer to the shop manual on how to do this with your particular vehicle. Set the jack stands under the frame of the vehicle. Remove the rear wheel. Remove the air spring solenoid clip. Rotate the solenoid counterclockwise to the first stop. To bleed the air from the system, pull the solenoid straight out slowly to the second stop. Once the air is completely bled out of the system, rotate the solenoid to the third stop and remove the solenoid from its housing. Remove the upper air spring retainer clip. You can access this through the gap between the frame rail and the body. Since our body has been removed, there's not a clip. You can see at the top of the air spring where the clip would be on your vehicle. Using a pry bar or a large screwdriver, remove the lower spring seat from the axle assembly. Be sure to remove the retaining clip from the lower spring seat as well. Remove the lower shock nuts and bolts. Then pull the shocks away from the mounting. This will allow more space between the axle and the frame to make it easier to install the coil springs. Place the coil spring into the upper and lower seats. The tighter wound coils must be towards the top. Jack the axle up and replace the lower shock nuts and bolts. Tighten them to 52 to 85 foot pounds. Tie up all loose wiring and air lines to prevent them from dragging or coming in contact with the exhaust pipes. Replace the wheels and tighten lug nuts to between 85 and 105 foot-pounds. As previously mentioned, we are only showing you one side. Repeat the steps for both sides as you go through the process. Lower the vehicle and you will have completed the conversion. Westar your air suspension specialist. Westar offers many types of quality auto parts, air suspension parts, motor and transmission mounts, suspension strut mounts, drive shaft supports. Thank you for choosing Westar as your auto parts supplier.